to get this joke. So, <laughs> next comedian, he's got the name of a generic sharecropper. It's John Fields! <laughs> How's it going? How's it going? My name is John Fields. I don't even expect me. <laughs> All right, that was up. This is my first time doing stand up comedy, so please try not to laugh at me. All right, so listen. So, I'm a Virgo, and they, they like to say Virgo people are narcissistic sometimes and whatnot. I don't believe it. I don't even get into the zodiac sign and whatnot. <laughs> but I guess, you know, I do got like a, a trait sometimes where I don't be thinking to learn people's names. Like I'll, I'll work at a job. If a job, what's up? What's up, bro? What's going on? I don't even know your name. There was a girl I talked to once. You know, we was, we was doing the deed. We was chilling afterwards. She randomly asked me, so what's my name? I was like, oh, God damn <laughs> <laughs> On Snapchat, your name is Sandra. <laughs> Damn it! I was like, why the hell you didn't tell me your name? If I, was, I met you on Snapchat. <laughs> she ain't in there. Oh, crazy part about that. Uh, she ended up running her boy, um, baby daddy over with a car after reading the text message. So I got lucky out of that. <laughs> I made it out because I didn't remember her name. I mean, I ran me over a car and I ain't nobody there. I don't know how I got out of that, but so that's that, that's that. It's tax season. It's tax season. So, uh, you know, people that did the PPP loan, you know, they about to file their taxes thinking they about to get their tax return. Not knowing the government waiting for five years and she and my tax return for five years. <laughs> they ain't they put that together. They put that together. I'm a big Bengals fan. I'm a big Bengals fan. And we, and we all know they cheated. They threw those flags. So I'm, I'm thinking to myself like, we probably got to, we kind of got, we kind of got to get our money up so we can pay for people to cheat for us. Sure. Like, like they waited, they waited for us to, you know, get good at the football thing, and now we got to get good at the cheating. <laughs> Damn. Why well, obstacles? I've been waiting my whole life for to be good. Now I got a cheating chick, so we're gonna, we're gonna start a Super Bowl GoFundMe for the Bengals. Put a max like ten million. Some shit. Roger Cordell, this is for you. Better take it. Well, listen, listen. So I take y'all back to when I was in the fourth grade. I was I had a, a Kings Island trip I was gonna go on. All I had to do was get a signature for one of my parents. Easy mission, I ain't got to pay. I was like, ah, oh, shit. I'm going to King's Island. I'm going to so I, 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 I go, I go to, I, so I get the permission slip. I go home, looking for my mom, you know, that's the first person I'm looking for. Oh, but she's at work, and I wanted to go out and play some basketball with my friends. So I'm like, let me make sure I get this shit signed before, because it's the next day. Like, let me get this signed. So I get a sign, the, the, the next person I was to, I couldn't find my mom. So I'm like, hey dad, can you sign my, my permission slip? He signed it. So I'm like, oh shit, we're going to King's Island tomorrow. I, not that I know I wasn't going to King's Island tomorrow, yeah, I probably wasn't. I go to school the next day, and the lady like, do you think I'm done? Do you think I'm stupid? I was like, what? She said, you signed this permission slip. I was like, no, I did my dad sign it. Man, he right worse than me. We got the same name, so she said, you signed your own, I was like, my dad named John Fields. <laughs> <laughs> the wrong numerals on there? <laughs> right, I don't get it, I don't get it. But that's that, you know. Hey, so, so uh, oh, funny story, funny story. So this girl I met, I met her on Instagram. She's one of those 300 likers, you know. It's, you know, it's hard to keep their attention, or even get their attention. I got her attention. It was good, it was about to go on a date and whatnot. It was going, no, it was never, it didn't get to the date. I just, I just texted her, I was just texting her. She stopped texting And I forgot about it, that's how you gotta do it. As a guy, you know, you gotta just know somebody and if they just stop wanting to know you, just deal with it and move on. So I came across her again on Facebook. I was like, oh 
shit. That's not from Instagram. She don't fuck me now. So I just I DM her. She gave me her number. We set up a date. I was like, last time I didn't get a date that quick. That's kind of cool. So the date about to come up. She um she texted me the, the day um no the day before. She's like, so what kind of um gym office are you trying to rent out? I was like, who is I look at I look at her profile picture. I was like, that's her. I go over, it was her again. Went over three more pictures, seen an older man. I was like, what the fuck? That was a proud father with his daughter as a cover photo. I was texting her dad. <laughs> <laughs> and, he was like, and he had a business where he rented gyms out. Like, oh, damn, I was happy. Thought about being married. <laughs> I was leaving on that pretty heavy. But you know, it's all good. Uh, I don't think too much of it. I did not do a PPP loan, so I will be getting my taxes. I'm not one of those guys. Even though, I mean, I wish y'all had heard about it before it was expired. I was like, shit! I found some way that somebody, I was just give me 25% of that shit. I'm, just, I'm putting you on. <laughs> but uh, that's all I got for you today, man. My name is John Fields. Yeah.